Good morning friends, welcome to Engineering Clinic. Today we are going to see how to use uh, Ubuntu inside a MacBook Air M4. So I am going to use a software called as Multipass given by Ubuntu or Canonical itself. So you just go to Multipass in Ubuntu.com website where you can able to uh, create something like a container based system called as Multipass. Download the software like this and after this download it. Just install the software so you can able to use this for Linux as well as you can use it for uh, Windows all the three OS you can able to use it now I am just using this in uh, Mac OS yes, installation over after the installation you just go into multipass software you can see this is how the way it looks like open the software so once you open the software there will be one catalog where you can it will be listing all the uh, pre-compiled or pre-installed linux operating system available there so ubuntu 24 24.10 22.04 20.04 now 24.04 is april 2024 it was launched you can use that just uh, go to the configuration uh, give the name of the OS. this name cannot be changed in future so give it a voice name that you can remember I am giving it as engineering clinic uh, don't give any blank space or anything after that how many CPUs you want so I want to give two CPUs and how much RAM you want to give I want to give 4 GB RAM and storage is I want to give it as uh, 60 GB storage in case if you want to copy files between Ubuntu and Mac OS you can use add mount option there so which is given over here you can able to use the add mount where all the Mac files you can able access in Ubuntu and the other works and once you click start then uh, the terminal will be opened here it might take some time for the first time so you can able to use it so this is how the way you get a terminal so using this terminal uh, mode you can able to completely operate the Ubuntu operating system within Mac OS so since Mac OS is too fast enough so we are giving 4 GB RAM for the Ubuntu you can feel that it is very fast enough uh, to handle it and this way you can able to use Ubuntu but uh, the thing here is you can able to use Ubuntu only on the uh, ARM, or ARM version architecture 64 bit so it is not an Intel uh, Ubuntu it is an ARM Ubuntu so Ubuntu gives uh, OS for ARM, ARM as well as Intel so we have uh, in this multipass it will be by default giving since it is a Mac OS M4 is also an ARM controller it will give accordingly but there is another method to access it in case if you want to stop the multipass you can use stop suspend or delete whatever you like you can able to do if you don't want the OS you can simply delete it so that you can regain all the complete space out of it now in case if you want to go with the second method I open the terminal of uh, Mac OS now you can see that I am just uh, maximizing the terminal size uh, which cannot be possible in multipass here another method of opening the uh, Ubuntu here within uh, Mac OS so I prefer this method because uh, the native terminal of Mac OS we can uh, able to use we can make a bigger fonts like that the command is like this multipass execute exec engineering clinic space slash bin slash bash so we have to give the shell what shell you want to use it so once you give enter immediately it will appear you can see that engineering clinic and ubuntu at engineering clinic so you can get immediately now let me say i can able to use the commands here sudo apt update so once i do the update i could able to see yes so now i can see that uh, what architecture it shows so you can see that uh, arc 64 means arm architecture 64 bit and the name of the kernel is linux so you can see that linux is the kernel so and when i exit it i am coming in mac u name hyphen a when i use mac here you can see arm uh, darwin is the name of the kernel and arm 64 is the arm architecture 64 now this is uh, m4 and it is arm 64 architecture so this is how the way the ARM OS will be so the Ubuntu OS for ARM architecture will be installed uh, and uh, in case if you are uh, very fond of using Ubuntu for a longer period of time and if you have uh, purchased a MacBook Air or a MacBook or any Mac machine you can use this method to access the uh, Ubuntu so this is a very lightweight and uh, you can manage the memory very easily but if you use a hypervisor like VMware or Oracle VirtualBox you can it might take some uh, heavy uh, space better you can able to use this thank you friends thanks for watching